Hey there everybody, it's been a little while since I've been on a video. I've had a few days uh, with some family and friends and had to attend to a few matters. I'm just in the middle of transiting, I'm traveling here. I'm on the Gold Coast in Surfers Paradise again. If you haven't seen me here before, I've been here uh, for a little bit uh, in this last couple of months. Um, so I just want to talk about one thing I'm noticing a lot of people in business, even if you're starting out, even if you've been in business for a little while or you're an established business, I'm surprised at the number of people who don't hang their shingle out and let people know that whether what business they're in. Um, and so what I mean by that is a lot of people just don't talk to people about what they do and how they help people. And so this makes it very difficult. If you don't tell people, it means your doors are closed. Your doors should always be open for business. Uh, whether you're a freelancer, somebody starting out, somebody who's building a small agency, somebody who's building a bigger agency, you wanna let people know that you exist in the marketplace. So how do we do that? First thing we've gotta do, and I don't know why people don't do this, is let people know who you know friends, family, associates, colleagues, alumni, social friends, social media friends. Let them know what business you're in. I make an offer to say, hey, teach people what you know on how they can get a benefit from what you do so you can maximize their opportunity to help them to open the door for you to generate clients. That's number one, letting people know and then allowing them to let other people know that if they need help with a service that you provide, they can come to you. Second thing, is you need to start building some, building some digital assets. You've got to get some personal branding, some business branding, so letting people know. So one of the ways in which you do this is create some content, create some pieces, some what I call signature pieces. Um, sorry for the Ferrari that just uh, literally drove past me. Uh, very noisy in a very uh, slow uh, part of town. So anyway, um, so you want to make sure that you have some digital assets. What I mean by that is the easiest way to do this is answer the problems. What are the key problems that people have in the marketplace in relation to the service that you offer? And answer those questions. Create a PDF, a report, answer the questions with a video, uh, answer the questions with some content, put it on your site, brand your business as the problem solver and the results getter for the problem that the market is having. So you wanna create some personal branding, some digital assets, because people are gonna check you out and people wanna see that you are legitimate, that you are in business and you're a legitimate business owner. The second thing, just you wanna let, uh, you know, from a professional point of view, if you're in the B2B space, you wanna update your LinkedIn profile because people are looking for you, they are searching for you, and so you wanna make sure that what they see is something that's professional and that is going to help them to see that you solve a problem and they should be reaching out to you. So in your LinkedIn profile, make sure you're using your keywords to target your market. Make sure you're using the summary section to articulate how you help people. Not, uh, this is my resume, right? How you actually help people, how you help people get results, how you help people solve the problems that they have in the market in relation to your service, and even make an offer in that summary section to say, hey, if you want a little bit more, let's sit down, I can show you or I can teach you, I can share with you how you can get amazing results with that. So there's three things. Next thing, look at business groups in your area. I don't mean online or internet marketing groups or entrepreneur groups. I'm talking about local business groups in your city. So for example, I'm here in Surface Paradise. There is a Facebook group for Facebook business for businesses right here in this city and I can join that Facebook group and there are some pretty big businesses in that Facebook group that I can now engage socially with. I can private message, I can uh, answer questions, I can even offer to share things that I know will help people get amazing results. It's a fast way to become known within a business community as somebody who is there to help and somebody who's there to support that community. So there's three things that you can do right now, letting people know your familiar list, letting them know who you are, what you do, how you help people, and how do you get a result. Number two, start creating digital assets, branding, personal branding, business branding, so they know that you're an authority, an expert in solving a problem so they can identify with you. Uh, get on LinkedIn and make sure that you manage your profile a little bit more effectively, letting people know because they will search you, they will look for you on the social media platforms, and it does give you awesome SEO ranking for you your name in LinkedIn. And the fourth thing is connect with a business group in your local market, a business group for the city, town, whatever, you, wherever you are, and start adding value into that group. Start asking questions, start sharing how you can help with help people and open yourself up to some business. So remember what you want to do. And most people don't do this and I have no idea why, or maybe they just completely forget about this idea is you want to hang out the metaphorical shingle to let as many people know 
that you're in business, that you're open for business, and you want to help people out with what you do. Thanks for watching. Hey, keep an eye out for another post. A little bit later today, I'm holding an event right here in Service Paradise for consultants, people who are starting their business, people who are in business, people who are scaling their businesses in the agency and the consulting markets. And I'm going to be sharing some really cool stuff, two-day event uh, right here. And I'm also going to give you $1,000 cash towards coming to the event. There is an early bird ticket you can purchase. Uh, the event is 60 days away on the 8th and the 9th of November right here in Service Paradise on that amazing beach that you can actually see just over my shoulder in the background there. So look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. Um, take care. Talk to you soon.